Well, hello there, Chili Rocks here. If you've ever wanted to play a game starring Steven Seagal, uh, this is one for you. So this is Steven Seagal's Archipelago Survival, and we're going to check it out today and see what it's like. How can that not be good? It's going to be amazing. Okay, this is more like it. Um, uh, th that doesn't look like I thought that was a dog. Bad dog. Bad dog, you look like a zombie. Am I a zombie as well? Oh, he's got the look. Do I need to fight it or can I can I avoid him? Okay, there's, 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 um, I don't really want to fight zombies. Can I, can I, can I, what? I can just literally ignore them. There was something to pick up over here, though. Ah. Oh. I'm sure I'm playing the game completely wrong. <laughs> right, here we go. Let's go and pick this up. What's in what's inside it? Okay, let's take all. Right, I now ha I finally have a weapon. Here we go. Okay, justice is served. Okay, let's leave this forsaken Oh, there's a stewardess there. Let's do a surprise attack on her. Can we? No, we can't. Oh no, I was trying to beat her. No one is worrying here. I'm just excited. Zombie apocalypse finally. It can be dangerous outside, believe me. As a former Marine, I know what I'm talking about. Come on, can we not hit her anyway? No. Whoa, look at the little crop top. The little crop top on a zombie. There's, there's too many of them. <laughs> a zombie in a crop top. I never thought I'd see the day. Dangerous. Great. At last, I have a chance to test myself in the real trial. Follow me. Wait, miss. We should go the other way. Screw it. Arms. Get ready. Zombies. I'm going to... What? This is the most amazing English I've ever read. Okay. Mar <laughs> Mariner? Stop dying. I'm Sergeant Rick. I'll teach you how to treat any wound with a bandage and a laxative. <laughs> what? <laughs> that is just surreal. Okay, so is, is there going to be bandages in this? Yes, there is. Okay. Take all. Click that. Click use. Okay, it seems a laxative has worked. No doubt about it. Now you need to change your equipment. Try this on. Okay, she's so giving me some new stuff. Okay, let's take that. Click it. Click use. Okay, I am now an honorary member of the army. Fine, do you know how to handle a weapon? It's easier to handle a weapon than a woman. <laughs> then take this gun. What? Who on earth has even written a dialogue to, for this? Okay, right. So we're, we're getting a gun. We're clicking use. Uh, I'm putting on my backpack, the bat. Right, oh, nice gun, awesome. Those creatures are terribly hard to kill. Aim only at the head. Speak of the devil. What are you waiting for? Shoot. Hang in there, I'm coming. Right, I... Uh, okay. There's, 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 there's quite a few of them, you know. What? How many... Shots the Oh Okay, I'm 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 now hiding in the woods. Have I got infinite ammo, I wonder? <laughs> we are unstoppable. Well maybe. Let's go back to the uh where's me where's my buddy gone? Oh no! I didn't have a chance to explain. Hush, save your breath. 
keep take my radiance work and get out of here along my steps you know there's footprints in the sand there's a shelter out there find it and sorry it turned out like this it shouldn't now it's your duty too wow what is my duty ah oh, damn good night sergeant rick rest in peace i need to take care of these zeds okay that's them all taken care of i think i've looted all these then there was nothing in these was there why why can't we pick his machine gun up? Okay, I guess we need to follow the uh, footprints then. That was an intro and a half. Um, not too sure about the dialogue. It's I don't know if it's tongue in cheek or just really, really terrible. It's uh, <laughs> certainly an interesting monologue that's been going on. Okay, here's Mr. Air. Oh, here he is. Here's the main man himself. Admission. Is there someone alive? Can you hear me? You survived the crash. This means a lot. My partner Rick is dead. This means you're my only chance. On the other hand, you don't have much choice either. I'm on the next island watching you with the help of a recon drone. I'm your eyes and ears, get it? I give instructions, you carry them out. This is how we survive, over and out. I don't think we can really argue with him then. Without a proper weapon, you won't make it here. Know what? Search the boat. A repair kit was supposed to be on it somewhere. Use that to fix your weapon. At least you can try it. Depends on how good you are. Right, so we need to search this, so let's open this. And we've got all sorts of goodies. Right, so here's the repair kit. Let's repair my pistol. Nice. Come out of that. Right, our next step. Uh, Sergeant Rick kept a stash of supplies somewhere on the island for a rainy day. There should be weapons and food. Doesn't need any more. It might come in handy for you. I can't give you the exact location, but the... Our cast cave nearby. Look there, Rick was a huge fan of dungeons. Okay. Why does it want me to use my health? I don't think we've actually... No, we've not got any health. Not lost any health. Okay. Dead Sergeant Stash. Go to the location. So we need to find our way to it. Um, Is it going to give me a clue where it's going to be? Or... Doesn't tell me where it is, so I guess we're just going to have to run until we find it. Now, I'm assuming stuff like this, we can pick stuff up and make things. So, what's this? The little bamboo and a rock. A pineapple. Oh, I don't know if we're going to make something to eat or make the most amazing weapon. We've got a crafting thing. Still wants me to... Oh, we can craft this. So, we need three... Uh, bandages and two things of alcohol that's that's what first aid kits are made of apparently so if i got anything else in my inventory oh this is the whole crafting tab we need the inventory here we go am i hungry at all yet let's see can i oh so i've got a, a pant pocket let's put a pant a pineapple in my pant pocket let's try and make this again now there we go. Just made that nice little uh, medical thing there. Oh, so this is one. This is like uh, a few games I played where you use energy or you can walk. So you have an energy counter which will fill up in X amount of time. You'll get like, f you know, one energy or five energy. Or you can just walk there and it'll take the amount of time. So as I'm doing this uh, tutorial, we're running. Right. We're going to go to the cave. And see if we can find the secret stash chest. Cash is hidden in the depths of the caves. I know what else is going to be in these caves. There's going to be zombies. What's this say? Run from here. This already sounds like a good place to come, doesn't it? Okay, there's a zombie. Okay. <laughs> that, that was a little bit fast. Okay, it was... Can be exchanged profitably with Jack Sparrow, and we've got a clamp. There's more stuff this way. What's in this chest? This is definitely Rick's cash. Search him. Okay, what's this then? Sergeant Rick's notes. Our mission is on the verge of collapse. We lost contact with the outside world, and even worse, second group. We were planning a trip to a neighbouring island, where our target should be. That is, judging by the data, outdated for at least... Three days. It seems to me not worth rushing in 
in the absence of inf relevant information. But arguing with the chief is pointless. He'll just give me his poker face and do it as he says. Okay, that was chapter 31. Chapter 32. Um, GRA is unlike your ordinary left or right radicals. They are fanatics. Okay. Let's have a look at the end. What happened right at the end then? Creature lives on the rocks near the rift side, sits there for a reason, it guards the bridge. The ugly giant resembles a troll from a furry tail. I watched him for several hours. He let a couple of sectarians pass from beyond the lift, bowing his head at the sight of the Aleph sign on their robes. Okay. I don't want to fight that one. I don't know what that thing is, but that does not sound fun. We're going to go in for a stealth kill. Okay, stealth kill did not really. That, that wasn't really as planned. Managed to take him down, though. Hmm. Anyway, that's all I'm going to show you for now. So this is Steven Seagal's Archipelago Island. Uh, well, Archipelago Ghost Survival, sorry. Uh, if you have played this, what's it like later on in the, later on in the game? So it, looks, it looks pretty fun, but it's, it's the energy that always uh, annoys me with these games. It's... Uh, Pretty annoying having to wait to because I'm gonna have to run back to my home area now. 18 minutes to walk, or I can run with 18 energy. Hmm. Anyway, let me know what you think of it in the comments below. <laughs> I do quite like the dialogue. It is so terrible. It is good. Anyway, that's it for now. Thank you for watching. See you next time.